What's up everybody? So uh, here I am. It's a beautiful Saturday morning and I'm putting together this pig shelter with wood that I cut from a failed tree down on the property. Um, it's coming together but the thing that I hate the most is that um, the cuts aren't exactly the, the straightest and so there's a little warpage and bendage in some of the, the wood but I'm making do. It is just a pig shelter. I'm just gonna have to make sure I stabilize it up a lot better on the sides and make sure I tie everything in together good. So uh, I'll give you a short little, take a look, here we go. to turn that thing off so you guys can hear me so this is what i got so far you see the wavy cuts but it's coming together um yeah <laughs> i don't know what else more to say i guess uh i'm just gonna keep doing some little small excerpts of it and uh and show you as i go along so i got kind of a frame set up I'm gonna put these one by. I think the two, these two by fours are they're true to cut, so they're just super huge. But uh, I got these one bys that are probably just as strong as normal one by twos. I think is what they were, or one by fours that are probably just as strong as you know normal two by fours in today's society. So I'm gonna put these up on the corners and tie them, tie the walls in, put another brace along that side and I think what I'm gonna do is you know what I I'm looking at this now and I'm a little upset I can extend it out but I don't know if that's gonna be wide enough for three pigs hmm uh oh well I guess we'll see right now they're good I mean they can lay that way but i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to put either one door there for them to walk in and be in here like that or it'll be in the middle and it'll be two sides i think i like that better but i'm not exactly sure maybe i'll do one in the middle and go from there but all right we'll just see how it goes hey buddy what is it oh here comes kane gotta come over Okay, so what I decided, all right, you can't look at level in this because, well, like I said, the boards are <laughs> crazy, but that could just be me too. Anyway, so I just, I decided that I'm going to go with one door here um, so they can go in and then they have all that, that way it gives it in a sort kind of like that, but that's just right. Um, they can go in there and and really get away from the elements and stuff like that too. So one door, slide overhang on each side. Um, now I'm gonna, I got the wood right here. And I'm gonna start using that for siding. Well, first one I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a, like these one bys and put them up as studs. And that's what I'm gonna use to put up the, the planking around it. Um, I don't think I have enough to do the roof. I'm gonna do the sides first and I'll find something for the roof um, when the time comes, I guess. If I gotta go get some uh, plywood or something like that to throw up there for the time being. But I'm trying to make it all from what's on the property already. So I'm sure use that's here. But, you know, if I can get the mass majority of it with that wood and then go spend $500 for a piece of plywood, then I guess that's what I'm going to have to do. But, all right, uh, so this is it. Uh, I'll see if I can put some time lapse on and maybe do a couple other little things. I'll put these ribs on or maybe I'll just uh, 
do the same thing and just keep going in uh, splurts or whatever. So, all right, appreciate you. Well, that's as far as I get today. I got boards on the front and I got boards on the back. I need to do something with size and a roof. But I am out of wood. I'm out of slats. So I guess what I do is maybe I either use the siding from that, but they're not long enough. I have to put, I got a couple other boards I could put in the middle. That way I could do that. And I could get another tarp for the roof. Um, it should be high enough to keep that one from doing that because he likes to chew on tarps. So, gotta figure it out what I'm gonna do here. I'm not quite sure, but uh, like I said, I'm pretty happy with it. And it's all wood that I got from, if you look at my previous videos of me slabbing out uh, a tree that fell on the property, this is it. So I'm not, I'm not upset about it at all. Very extremely rough cut. But this thing is extremely solid. It's not as portable as I thought that I might have would have made it. Um, and I don't have forks for the tractor yet. But I, I can figure something out to move it. Um, but this thing is just out it's huge and uh well, i don't know where's i don't know i don't know <laughs> uh, but that's where i'm at right now so i'm gonna uh, clean up my mess that fire still just don't want to do anything it's been pretty irritating so all right let me clean up my mess And then there's King. Oh. What do you call that? Jealous. Oh, jealous. Pick up socks. <laughs> oh my goodness. Relax.